praise the Lord. God bless you in Jesus' name. You are welcome to today's message. May God bless you and may God reward you and your entire family in Jesus' name. The Lord will lift you up. You will be rewarded in the name of Jesus. I declare that heaven will speak to you direct in Jesus' name. Amen. Today we are talking about reward of obedience. Reward of obedience. Our text is from Job 36, verses 11. Job 36, verse 11. If they obey and serve him, they shall spend their days in prosperity and their years in pleasures. Reward of obedience. When you obey God, there's a reward that follows. When you obey the voice of God as a child of God, when you hear God speak to you and you obey Him, there's a reward. Deuteronomy 28, the Bible said in from, from verse 1, if you hearken diligently to the voice of God, if you obey His voice, you will eat the fruit of the land. That is the reward. Every reward from God comes from God's heart. And it has what is called human factor before God factor. When God said, I will bless you, that is God's own factor. He will bless you. There's just something you need to do for the blessing to come. Many Christians have run away from that. Most of times we don't see that to discover that God never said, I will do this to you without telling you to do this. Abraham, I will make you great. I will make you great. Your name will be a great name and I will bless you. But you have to leave your country, leave your kindred. Today, I declare, the Lord will give grace to obey him and you shall have a reward in the name of Jesus. And any one of you who have obeyed God all this year that will be asking where is your reward, I speak as a servant of God. This month will bring that reward to you in the name of Jesus. You have served long and you'll be asking God where is my reward? I believe you for a child. I believe you for a husband. I believe you for a house. I've been looking for a job. Listen to me. In number 23 verse 19, God said I'm not a man I cannot lie. I have spoken it and I'll bring it to pass. He will give you that reward in the name of Jesus. The first reward, long life. Deuteronomy chapter number 4 verse 40. When you serve God, he will give you long life. So long life is what God will give you. Psalm 91 verse 16. The word of God said I will sanctify you with a long life and prosperity. Number 2. When you serve God, you receive unexpected favor. Unexpected favor. When you serve God, you just wake up like this. And what you never imagine that God will give you will come. Because you have served Him. Number two. Number three, I mean. Service to God promotes worship. Worship. Those that serve God are the ones that worship God the best. Beloved, keep on serving Him. Keep on serving him. If he serve God, for example, the Bible said to a man called Saul from the mouth of Samuel, Samuel said to Saul, service of God is more than sacrifice. Now, the last one I want to mention is that service of God brings authority and power. Service of God brings authority and power. And when you serve God, you have the authority and power. Can I declare to you this hour that the power that your family and generation have not been used is coming upon you because of the service of the living God. I decree upon you in the mightiest name of Jesus Christ. And I declare in the name of Jesus, receive that reward. I pray in the name of Jesus, long life will come. Unexpected favor will come. And the great grace to worship God will come upon you. And the another thing that the heavenly God will give you an authority. Authority to pull stronghold of the kingdom of darkness. Another great reward of serving God is eternity. You make heaven when you serve God. 
It's not only going, it's not those who go to church that make heaven. It's those that serve God. In the book of John chapter number four, he said, God is the spirit and those that serve God will serve him the truth and his power. So I declare, child of God, you will have the reward of God from today. Let me pray for you. Let me bring down the glory of God upon your life. You are blessed. Receive the reward of your service. Receive the reward of your obedience to God in the name of Jesus. You are blessed. The next time I'll hear from you, it shall be a testimony of the reward of your obedience to God. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Amen. You are blessed. Stay blessed and remain the atmosphere of deliverance. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen.